like so sad the way that some people have to live and London is so hard to live in because unless you have loads of money it just sucks like it's so expensive to live in London I do love it though safety safety is a big one I've had people try to steal my phone off me I've had like multiple instances in London people following me people shouting out cars at me like when I walk around in London, I'm very cautious about who's around me, if I've got my phone in my hand, you know, stuff like that. But when I'm outside of London, like more in the countryside, I don't have to think about that. Like, you know that you're safe. Your car got stolen twice. See, this is the thing. London is like just insane. You can't wear a watch in London. It's going to get stolen. Your phone you can't have out. It's going to get stolen. Safety is so bad. Like once I had, I was walking from my old apartment to Tesco and it was genuinely a two minute walk. I just had to cross the road and then walk down the road. Genuinely two minutes. On that two minute walk, bear in mind it's like 11 a.m. I'm going to get some something for breakfast. I'm like walking along on my phone because it's a two minute walk, it's 11 a.m. And I've lived there for a few months so I just think, oh, whatever. So I'm there walking on my phone. There's a guy on a bike who's on the pavement and like zooms past me and I'm like, huh? So I like, that alerted me, which was their mistake. Cause I was like, what? Another guy comes along on his bike, is like circling me, tries to grab my phone, misses like the loser he is. And then they both like kind of try again and then just dip. And I was like freaking out. I was stood by myself, like walking to the shop. I was like, oh my goodness. So I just kept walking to Tesco, walked into Tesco and just stood still and was like, oh my God. Luckily they missed which is embarrassing for them because I look like an easy target. I'm like a teenage girl, like walking on my phone. But I was so shaken up by it because I was like, I don't know if they've got knives. I don't know. With London nowadays, you just don't know. Scotland is much safer. Yeah, Scotland, I've never, like I go to Scotland all the time, never had an issue there. And the people there are so much friendlier than in London. Yeah, Dubai is safe for women. In Dubai, I felt very safe. Don't get me wrong, there was a few people that... Um, in Dubai were a little bit like a few men were a little bit creepy but you get that everywhere unfortunately um was this in Southwark by any chance it was near Southwark it was very near Southwark yeah <laughs> why remember from, from London yeah Chelsea London's not very safe but um it's like a it's a big city it's the same as other big cities you know I'm just blessed we don't have guns but you do have to worry about knives and stuff. Or like, have you seen the stuff where, um, like poison and stuff? I don't know. Or that part, oh, I don't want to go into it. Better conversation, let's not go down a hole. Morph, thank you for the follow. This is 4 a.m. conversations. London is safe and London also has guns. London is not safe, that's a lie. London, yes, has guns, but illegal guns, there's a difference. They're very rare. Of course, there's not zero guns. Yeah, machetes are crazy. Like it's normal to walk past someone that's like doing some madness in London. I'm not going into details, enough of this conversation. Most of London is safe, it's just not true. It's not safe. I guess if you if you compare po population, because population is big, population to crime, then like it's okay, but. <laughs> Who are you talking to, Arthur? <laughs> see who he replies to. Doesn't. <laughs> oh gosh. Better behave. Where can't you walk around safe? Okay, me as a young female in London, as soon as it gets dark, which are often times of the year is 5 pm, not even late, as soon as it gets dark, I can't walk around most of London by myself. Some places, yeah, if it's crowded, if it's popular, yes, I can walk around. But most places, as soon as it's dark, I feel very uncomfortable walking around by myself. I'm a girl. I am a victim. I'm an easy target. Like, let's be so real. What am I going to do? Scream. No, I'm, I'm going to do stuff. I have keys in between my knuckles. That's how I have to walk around sometimes. I'm a big man, but I feel safe. I get you. I'm sorry. Yeah, see, it's different. It's different for everyone. For some people, they feel safe. Like, if I was a big man, London would be calm. But I'm not. Southland is worse. Yeah. Okay. Hi Zoe, thanks for following. What are you saying okay to? Keep me right, yeah. 
This is the thing. What's everyone's opinion on pepper spray? Do you think it should be legal? Because I know it is in the US. Like you can carry around pepper kit, pepper spray. Sorry, you don't have to apologize. That's okay. Add me. Okay. Sure, I got you. For match. Okay, I got you. Um. Come on, I was gonna say. You see, I think it should be legal, but then I don't want someone to use pepper spray on me. But I think I should have it for self defense. But hairspray does a similar thing, perfume does a similar thing. If I spray perfume, which I always have on me, in someone's eyes, that's gonna hurt. Zoe, thank you, my love. Thank you, Zoe. Should be legal. Should be legal firearms, should be legal too, with a carry permanent here. I'm in the US. I don't agree. I don't think we should carry guns. But everyone's allowed their opinion, but I don't I don't agree with guns. Because, like, if someone's feeling angry that day, you can just whip out a gun. Like, I don't know. Why not? Why don't I believe in guns? Because, I don't know. I know, I understand the whole wanting guns for protection. But then aren't you doubling the problem? If no one has guns, or very little people have guns, so it's hard to get a gun in London. It's not impossible, fair enough, but it's very hard no one has guns, then we don't need guns to protect ourselves because no one has guns. But if everyone has guns, then yeah. If I lived in America, I would own a gun. I would put it in a locked box. I would never touch it, but I would own one because everyone else might have one. So I would think, okay, I need one too. Just in case someone pulls a gun on me, I have one. But if no one has a gun, I don't need a gun. UK police need guns for sure, for sure. Why are we getting on to like debates about whether guns should be allowed? It's an interesting debate to be fair, and I respect both sides. Your opinion is your opinion. You're completely allowed your own opinion, but I don't know. I just think from coming from a country that doesn't have guns, I very much see why we don't and why we shouldn't. Yeah, if everyone has guns, then I get it. Trust me, if I lived in a state that has guns in America, I would have a gun too. But it's a sad world. Why should we need guns to protect ourselves? Is, that, is our world actually that dangerous that we need to have a weapon? Clearly, but UK does have guns. This is what I'm saying, but it's way less. When do you ever hear about a shooting in London or in the UK? Yeah, you do, but not often. 